Hey guys, this is Elias Sky from Behind the Thing. Here's a uh, video review of Family Guy, the video game. First of all, I have to say, remember, I did get, if you saw my video of pickups, I got this game yesterday. As you can see, I got it pretty, I got it really cheap. I'm the pro member at GameStop, and so I got it really cheap uh, for pre-owned, and, and this works fantastic. I mean, I never had an issue with pre-owned games at GameStop. Um, yes, it's rated M for mature, and then it's uh, 2K games. And actually, you don't play as these guys. Well, Meg is right there. She's getting blocked by the sticker. And, uh, so, you know, but I think one game you play as uh, him, but you do see uh, these guys. Because there's, there's one game, actually, I'm stuck on where uh, Stewie tries to kill a bunch of losses in Peter's brain. Yeah, that's how just how wacky it is. I mean I love playing as Brian. Brian's my favorite character. He's fun. He's like kind of a stealth. And it, so the game actually the game features are you play as these three guys in three different events. So in story. So there's Stewie's story, there's Peter's story, and then there's Brian's story. And then they all crisscross and somehow Stewie's trying to beat up Bertram Peter is trying to beat up some guy, and Brian is trying to get himself free from jail. And oh, and then there's a lot of mini games in it. I mean, I I love the mini games. I think they're fun. I mean, there's like one where they do they actually redo Stewie's sexy party, which was really fun. And then they have like Quagmire, and then here's another mini game, which I thought was funny because I love horror movies. And if, I don't know if you can see that, but it says Quagmire's Blair Witch Project. I think we all know that was actually a horror movie. So I thought that was really funny. And um, so the three games kind of play as different ones. Stewie's is kind of a shooter up one. Peter's more like fighting, like Street Fighter, and Brian's more like stealth. Which is really cool. Um, yeah, this is still missing because I'm still playing the game, which is really funny, um, because I'm, like, stuck on it. It does have its difficulty, um, trust me. Oh, there's Meg. And then here's the manual. Sorry, I forgot to change with one. Ah, uh, black and white still. So this is has the no well not yet I'm not done yet. So this game is like really fun. It's really colorful. It's actually voiced by the same cast as the show Family Guy. Seth MacFarley, Seth MacFarley, Seth MacFarley, Seth, Seth Green, Alex something I found him and uh, Milo. Can't say her last name. Sorry. So I think that's really nice. And Mark Henry, who also plays Cleveland's in it. So Cleveland. It's a small minor role. Some guys do like Quagmire, Joe. They all get minor roles. Loretta. And they all get minor roles. But they, you know, it's still fun. So I do recommend this game if you can. If you're a big fan of Family Guy, I do recommend this game. You'll love it. And you'll get some of the hidden references in this game. So I recommend it. So if you could, go out and get it right now. You know, shut the hell up, Meg. And go buy it. So this has been Behind the Thing, uh, I mean, Aaliyah Scott from Behind the Thing. And remember to subscribe to this uh, uh, YouTube channel, uh, Alex Wolford, for the latest news and reviews on books, video games, and much, much more. See you guys later.